Justice for Jessica delivered today. It's been just over a year since 10 year old Jessica Ridgway disappeared. Well, today, her teenage killer, Austin Sig, learning he will spend the rest of his life behind bars. 7 News reporter Russell Haythorn in the courtroom for today's sentencing. Russell, prosecutors wanted to make sure that Sig dies behind bars. And today's sentence all but ensures he will. He got life in prison for the murder charge, plus 86 consecutive years on top of that for the kidnapping, sexual assault, and robbery charges. Honorable Stephen Munsinger, Chief Judge, now presiding. Day two in court started with Austin Sig's attorneys arguing he should receive a life sentence with parole after 40 years. The court would be presumptuous and speculative to assume at this early age because of an act by a child that that child would never be appropriate for parole. Prosecutors argued otherwise. The founding fathers of this country did not set forth an amendment that says when a young man kidnaps, robs, sexually assaults, and murders it and dismembers a 10 year old girl that everything other than the murder should be excused. The judge agreed, sentencing Sig to life with parole after 40 years for murder, but then adding time on top of that for kidnapping and sexual assault. There is to be confined for what I anticipate will be the rest of his natural life. At that point, one of Sig's attorneys mouths, are you okay? Sig replies, yeah, I'm fine. He was expressionless most of the day. You'll recall Jessica's disappearance last fall triggered a massive search. The discovery of her body five days later shocked the region. Sig confessed about two weeks after that, calling himself a monster. It was truly a reflection of pure evil, and, it, and Austin Sig deserves everything he got. The Jefferson County DA tells 7 News SIG will be isolated from the rest of the prison population for his own protection and then eventually, most likely, he will be moved out of state, according to the DA, again for his own protection from other inmates who target child sex offenders. Live in Jefferson County, Russell Haythorn, 7 News.